Y'all know nothing about this. You need to pay attention. Sit back and relax. It's time for Good Alls Country Kitchen. We're here outside Richmond, Kentucky on I-75. We're at Bucky's. Uh, some people would think of Bucky's as like a truck stop, but it's actually a travel plaza, uh, travel center for you know people on vacation, stop off, get gas, get food. Uh, one of the first things that caught my attention about this place was their brisket barbecue sandwiches that they serve here, which I'm gonna show you some of that later. There's also a lot of other good features, uh, clean restrooms, different things, customer service. Uh, I'm going to show you all that. Once we get in here, we're going to take a look around, and then we're going to finish it off with some good barbecue. As you look around here, you see it's like you think you were at the Kentucky State Fair. There must be 5,000 people here right now. Look at all these cars. And this is just one end of it. It wraps around this way, around the whole uh, uh, circumference of the building. All right, so let's go on in now. All right, one of the first do's and don'ts I'm going to tell you about is if you're going to go in after you pump your gas, be courteous and don't leave your car here because as you can see, there's a paint over there. There's people lined up a half a mile long trying to get in here. So just show some common courtesy. your car to a parking spot also let me show you why i'm over here uh well look down there 2.99 you can always guarantee wherever you're at a bucky's it's gonna be 20 to 30 cents cheaper per gallon than any of the truck stops near it so that's another reason why you want to stop at bucky's all right we're just as soon as i'm done pumping this gas i'm gonna move my car and we're gonna go on in first of all let me show you this is kind of like a shopping mall they have a humongous retail. Uh, you can buy clothes and different kinds of uh, gifts, things like that. All kinds of sports apparel. So if you want to do some shopping, you're going to have plenty to look for and go through here. One of the big features here at uh, Bucky's is they have their own line of beef jerky. Look at all this. All kinds of different flavors. Teriyaki, cherry maple, lemon. Uh, just about anything you want. Pepper jerky, uh, turkey jerky. They got it all. Okay, they even have their own line of homemade fudge here. Bucky's fudge. Look at all this. I'm telling you what, anything you're looking for, they've got it here. You've got different kinds of burritos, veggie burritos, all kinds of Texas cheese steak, chicken burritos, chicken fajitas, Texas cheese steak burritos. Just when you didn't think they had enough, they even have their own bakery. Have their own donuts, pastries, cookies. Excuse me. <laughs> oh yeah, everything just looks top notch. More retail area where you can buy groceries and uh, drinks and different kinds of trail mix packages and candies. And of course, notice over here these checkout lines. They got several lines going through. Just look at this place. There's this place is packed thousands of people and they just move you right on through you don't have to wait for anything okay here's another one of those features i was telling you about the restrooms as you see they even have world famous they have actually won national awards on how clean their restrooms are here and like when you start getting within a few miles of the buckies uh, on the interstate you'll start seeing the signs where they say come potty like a rock star well this is why you could go in there and just not have to worry about any dirty bathrooms. Uh, I would take you on in and show you a tour, but I don't think that that would be appropriate. Hooray! Hooray! 
Said, you don't have to wait for anything. They're just constantly pumping these sandwiches out. Bucky's chips, fresh fried potato chips. You can even get a healthy uh, option there with a barbecue turkey sandwich. But look, they're just throwing these things together as fast as they can make them. All right, here's another one of the don't don'ts. Everybody thinks that you need to check out here in this middle area. It tends to get a lot of congestion, you can see, long lines. But I'm gonna show you another little tip. You always check out down there at the very end, which I'm gonna show you in just a second. You never have to wait in a line down there. As I said, quick and friendly. It's all about the customer service here. Uh, no ma'am. Thank you, appreciate it. All right, back out here at the car, as you see, you can see we just uh, we just left Gatlinburg, got the car all packed here. But anyway, I'm gonna start off with this chopped brisket sandwich. You can see they're not stingy with the meat. Look at that. And the sauce is already uh, mixed into it. Nice little bun. Mm, nice big bun, I'm sorry. Mm. That's tangy. The sauce has a good sweetness to it. I'm gonna wash it down with some of this Diet Pepsi. All right, be back in just a minute. I'm gonna preview, review a couple more items. Be right back to you. Next on the list is the fried chicken sandwich. You can see it comes with like a, uh, like a chipotle mayonnaise and pickle. Kind of like, reminds me of like a Popeye's chicken sandwich a little bit. But let me see what it tastes like. Mm. Mm. A nice breading. Has a nice little zest to the breading on that sandwich. The pickle mixed with that, that zesty, uh, or actually it's a, kind of a tangy Dijonade or Chipotle mayonnaise, something like that. Tastes really good with it. All right, be back with a couple more items. Just a second. All right, as I said, Bucky's is known for the barbecue. So I went ahead and got their pulled pork sandwich too. As you can see, they're not stingy with that pulled pork either. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a try. It's good. It's got a good smokiness to it. And that sauce, as I said, with the brisket, the sauce is already mixed in it. It's got a little sweetness to it, but it goes good. It accompanies with that smoky flavor. Really good. Be back in just a minute. All right. On the last of the list on sandwiches, I got the chopping block roast beef and Swiss. It comes with mayonnaise and red onion. And as you see, again, plenty of meat on there. So I'm gonna go ahead and start in on this. Mm. That bun, it's really fresh. You can see there. For y'all that don't like the barbecue brisket, this might be your choice here, a little change of pace for a cold sandwich. That roast beef, you can tell it's fresh. It's uh, like cooked kind of medium, still kind of juicy, really good. And last but not least, your meal would not be complete without dessert. Ah. Some beaver nuggets. I had these once before. They're pretty good. 
kind of like a, a caramelized popcorn, but that's not popcorn. I don't know what the, how they make these, but they're, they're really light. And as I said, it's got like a caramel coating to it. Really good. All right. This is the only Bucky's in Kentucky. It's the first and only here in Richmond. So as I said, I didn't really know much about Bucky's until several months ago. It was advertised that this one was opening up. And then shortly after that, we'd be going on vacations, going up and down the interstate, and you'd see Bucky signs everywhere, like Bucky's 80 miles away from here. Make sure you stop. Uh, potty like a rock star signs, all that stuff. Anyway, definitely put this on your list if you're going on vacation. This is a perfect place to stop, take a break, do a little shopping, and of course, get some top-notch quality food. All right, with that said, y'all don't know nothing about this Bucky's. Now you know the facts of why I'm on a mission.